Well, people bring me all kinds of stuff. They know I work on old mopeds and motorcycles, and um, occasionally people will bring me something like this. So I figured I'd do a quick video of, you, of this for you, uh, kind of show you how it's all put together. So um, someone took a cheap, huffy bicycle, and usually, for whatever reason, when I've seen most people build these, they, they pick like a pretty subpar bike uh, to start building it with. And they took a pull off a uh, Mac 1010 chainsaw. And basically, um, you can see one of the hard things about any of these, what they call like chainsaw bikes, is figuring out how to mount the engine, the power head of the, uh, the motor of the chainsaw. And what you can see here is they've got a brace, got like a piece of pipe bracing there. Um, these is the bottom mount, and then they actually put like a bolt through here to go, which was kind of a kind of an interesting idea. Now the throttle for this, you can see that they actually worked a cable through here. This is the throttle cable, so it's a twist style throttle cable like a traditional moped, right? So twist throttle, you should be able to spin this now. It's kind of locked up, so I'm gonna work on getting that lubricated. But actually, you know, when you pull that, twist that throttle back, it's gonna, that cable, that Bowden cable is gonna pull and basically give it, uh, you know, uh, apply the throttle here. Um, they did cut off, you know, the, the pedals, which, okay, that's fair enough. The exhaust was rigged up with um, just a piece of tubing here that actually is better than what I've seen most of the time. Most of the time they've got a real short exhaust and it's kicking out the exhaust and you end up smelling like two stroke. But uh, having a nice little tailpipe there is better than what I've seen on most. So um, they do have a kill switch, which isn't isn't a bad idea for safety. And uh, so you got your twist throttle, maybe the choke. I have to look at that. Um, you know, and it's just a, well, that, that cover's loose, okay. I was gonna say, so that cover's loose. Um, I gotta, I gotta dig into this thing yet, figure out if I can get it to run. What else have we got going on? Okay, over here. So, let's see what, all right, so they just had this, okay. They, they must have had so you got a taper shaft there. They must have had a sprocket here. And you can see that these fins have been... I don't know if those... Are, I, I'm not exactly sure how they sort shortened those, if they just cut them down or what, um, to clear the chain. So then they have one chain to the drive sprocket, the rear wheel sprocket there. So the pedal sprocket, I should say, to the drive sprocket. So, okay. Well, I don't know. Someone took some time building this thing. Um, I'll see if I can get a video of it up and running, and we'll go from there. Thanks for watching.